so I'm gonna be reviewing the Cribbling automatic washing machine just got it in the mail got it from home, home depot it was 186 i took this part off of my sink it was easy to come off because we took it off in the past it came with these pieces it came with all the attachments i just gotta hook this up it clicks into place that part is plugged in right there got the drain hose right there so i guess this isn't on tight enough so i need to put it on tighter all right brb i'm having a hard time um this is hooking up fine to that but it keeps water is leaking from here so let me figure it out so it's no way in hell look at all this water it keeps leaking looks like i'm gonna have to buy another one of these what's the point of you know having this in a package if it's just gonna leak and not work and i have it in as tight as it can go so now i'm gonna have to buy another hose that's the connector right there hopefully it works so yeah like i was saying that's the part it was twelve ninety eight with tax fourteen oh two. And this better not leak because I was nice and warm in my apartment. I just don't understand why it would leak though. Um so yeah. We'll see. Catch it back at the house. So it says hand tighten then turn over the wrench. I don't know if I have one. Let me see. Ain't these pliers? I don't know. It says don't over tighten. So let me try. I got that there. Hopefully it doesn't leak. That was on the ground because of the leak. That's something that's going to get washed. So let's see if it leaks again. I'm going to put this here just in case because I just don't have time. This is annoying now at this point. I'm just waiting to make sure because before this is what was happening and it was leaking. Leaking down. So... It looks like it's okay, no leak. Usually when I do a big load, I use three. Um, I'm gonna use two. I'm washing that amount of stuff because I don't know how much can fit in the washer and I don't want to overdo it. So one, two, free and clear. All right, so power, water level. I'm gonna do like the five, six middle. I might do a quick wash, let's see. And start, I did a quick wash. Filling up, add in some fabric softener just a little bit. Two. All right, I'm gonna just load it up and come back. I have a dress and a tutu in there. That seems full. I don't know if I should add any more. I don't think so. All right, I went ahead and I added the skirt and the dress. That's all I'm gonna add. That's it. So it's saying like I guess a total of 22 minutes for a quick wash. Now it's starting. It's not completely covered. I could add more water. So it's just like sloshing it around right now. I'm gonna close the cover. It's not that loud, but um, oops, forgot to put that in a wash. But I will say, cause these are my kids' clothes. I would say this is definitely a small load. It's adding some more water. So maybe it needed more water. I don't know. This to my distrain. That's there. Um, I gotta get a lint catcher. Came with two extra wash and this little pamphlet thing. I watched enough like tutorials and I looked at this pamphlet on the Home Depot website. And once again, this is the crib crib bling brand. And I got it from Home Depot. I still got some of the plastic on there. I think my baby ripped some of that down came all plastic up and it came in this box i ordered it on the 23rd and today is march 8th it just came and i'm making this review because there wasn't there was like one or two youtube videos on this brand and they had a couple reviews on home depot but you know video wise mm -hmm. so it's still going it's sloshing the clothes around and like i said these are the majority of my kids clothes the machine is a decent size like this is my hip and it's like right below it's like right there on me and it's like the height is a little bit lower than my cat um countertop so it's not that big i mean it's big but it ain't that big and now the water is coming out that's all the water and i 
need to get a link catcher so the drain doesn't get stopped up. But yep, that is the water draining out. So now it looks like it's spinning. CC is rinse. So let's see how loud it gets. That's as loud as it is. It's spinning. Not loud at all. So now it's filling back up with water. I feel like now if you wanted to, to add fabric softener, it would be the time to do it. I put it in first, but now I know. I do it during the limb cycle. And I have my water faucet still on, so I never turned it off. I feel like if you get this brand, you need to get that cord, that um, water inlet. Because the one that I that came with it, it was leaking. So I'm going to end it because this is already like almost at seven minutes. That is my quick review. I can do an update when I use it more. Bye.